Welcome everyone to this interesting question where given to us is a quadrant with this blue line segment as tangent to the quadrant. Given is distance of this vertex of quadrant from the tangent is 5 cm and the distance of other vertex from the tangent is 10 cm. Exciting part is with this limited data we have to find area of this blue region. Let's check this simple and elegant solution. We'll solve the question in two parts. First we'll find the radius of this quadrant and then we'll find the area of blue region. Let's start by assuming the radius of quadrant as r centimeter. Let's join OB length where P is, B is point of tangency and thus it's perpendicular to the blue line segment. Let's do some construction here and from point A let's drop perpendicular on OB. Now here all the angles are 90 degree so it's a rectangle thus CB length that will be same as 5 cm and OC length that will be full length R minus 5. Same way here from point E let's drop a perpendicular on OC and this DB length will be same as 10 cm thus OD length that will be R minus 10. Now here let's assume this angle is alpha and this angle is beta degree. So alpha and beta are complementary angles and thus this remaining angle here that will be same as alpha degree and this angle will be beta degree. Now in this right angle triangle EDO it has got alpha r centimeter and beta degree and same way here in this triangle that's AOCA we have got angles alpha, r and beta degrees. So by angle side angle theorem, we can say both the triangles are congruent to each other. As the triangles are congruent, thus corresponding sides will be equal. Or we can say that ED length is equals to OC length. And OC length is what is r minus 5. And thus ED length will be r minus 5 or we can say this ED length here is R minus 5. Now in this right angle triangle ODE applying Pythagoras theorem we will get R square is R minus 5 square plus R minus 10 square. Opening the bracket and simplifying and taking all the terms on one side we will get this equation simplified in this form. Solving it by splitting the middle term. Now here either R is 5 or r is 25. Now from the figure we can make out r cannot be 5 otherwise r minus 10 here will become negative. So here we are getting the radius of quadrant is 25 centimeter. Now let's solve the second part that is to find the area of this blue region. For that let's construct a triangle with length as line length as same as this blue line segment and breadth or height as r centimeter. Now here in this if we look at this height this height will be same as r minus 10 but r is 25 so basically this height will be 15 centimeter. How about this length here this will be r minus 5 or 25 minus 5 that's 20 centimeter. Now here this length because the triangles are congruent so this length will be r minus 10 and r minus 10 is 15 centimeter. Same way this length here is your 20 centimeter. Now area of this triangle that's half of base into height half of 20 times 15 or 150 centimeter square. Same way area of this triangle will be 150 centimeter square. Now area of this quadrant that's pi by 4 times of r square r is 25 so it will be pi by 4 times of 25 square now area of blue region area of blue region will be area of this full rectangle full rectangle is 35 times 25 minus area of this triangle which is 150 minus area of this triangle that's 150 minus area of this sector Simplifying it, we'll get this as 575 minus 625 times pi by 4. 
simplifying it in decimal form we'll get our answer as 84.13 cm square and that's our answer i hope you enjoyed the solution i will see you in next video till then tata bye bye